A public inquiry into London's Grenfell Tower fire two years ago has blamed the disaster on systemic failings by the city's fire brigade. The Grenfell Tower fire was Britain's deadliest in a residential building since World War II. 72 people were killed when an ordinary kitchen fire turned into an inferno at the social housing block in West London in June 2017. The inquiry heard evidence from hundreds of witnesses and poured over more than 20,000 documents. For the latest on the report, let's speak to our correspondent in London, Natalie Powell. So Natalie, what were some of the key findings so far? Well, the inquiry found that there were systemic failings at the London Fire Brigade, that more people would have been saved had they evacuated the Grenfell Tower building earlier. Uh, the Fire Brigade, of course, has a policy called stay put, uh, so that those who are in the way of fire essentially stay put in their homes until the firefighters are able to catch able to get the blaze under control. Of course, in this instance, that wasn't going to be the case. And the findings suggest that as a result of that, once the blaze was clearly taking control of the building, that that stay put policy wasn't adequate enough and that people should have been evacuated sooner. It did, however, praise the firefighters that were there on the ground for their bravery in tackling this devastating fire in June 2017. But rose concerns about the comments made by the London Fire Brigade's commissioner saying that if she were to do it all again, she wouldn't change anything and therefore suggesting that there was a risk there that the institution was not going to learn from its mistakes. We have, however, heard from the London Fire Brigade's commissioner who has said that those comments weren't made as an offensive, in an, any kind of offensive way to the victims and their families. It was simply simply to try to indicate that the firefighters on the ground were doing their utmost. But really what these findings uh, seem to suggest is that the preparation for a fire to this extent just hadn't been done and that the London Fire Brigade was uh, found wanting in its preparations for such a fire. And Natalie, now that these findings have been released, uh, what should we expect next? Well, it now moves on to phase two. This, of course, uh, the, the first lot of it being phase one findings. Phase two looks more at the building and, and how this building performed during this fire. We know, of course, that the cladding on this building uh, was not in correct building regulations form. And uh, this cladding has been blamed a lot for the spread of the fire because it was very combustible. So um, modeling and that kind of thing hasn't been done yet but that is what we're going to expect from phase two as um, those in the inquiry try to establish just how the fire spread and what the main causes of that spread of fire were with regards to the building itself. All right, many thanks for that. Natalie Powell speaking to us from London.